Hey everybody, happy Monday, happy Cyber Monday. And uh, I hope you had a great Thanksgiving and hopefully you got some sweet Black Friday shopping done for your Christmas presents, for yourself, and found some sweet deals while doing so. So today, I am going to review a suitcase. A suitcase you may have seen on a Facebook or an Instagram ad. I'm talking about the Soul Gaird Carry-On Closet. I purchased one of these back in late October because I traveled for Thanksgiving. And um, last time I flew, my bag was rerouted. I landed at the airport and I had to wait an extra two hours to get my bag. I was angry. That was because of a mechanical issue on a flight when I was leaving Alaska. So I uh, shot out the money and I purchased the Soul Gear bag. So I'm going to grab it right now. So the bag is open right here, as you can see. Um, this is the closet thing. So this, let me get this even, sorry about that. This is your closet thing, so we're going to expand this. Okay, this is the closet. You pack your clothes in this, okay? You got multiple slots to pack your clothes. And you know, most of us pack differently, but uh, you know, try to, uh, you know, squeeze, you know, stuff in here like um, if you can. And uh, you know, the lighter you pack, the easier it can be to compress this bag together. So I'm a big guy, six foot six, six foot seven. So you know, my clothes are bigger than someone who's like five foot five. Anyway, so after you pack all your stuff, you know, pack in here. You take this, you compress it. Other side here, compress it. So it's like this. And you see this bottom part of the bag right here. This you just uh, put in here. Now this is very light, so there's nothing in it, so this will be a lot thicker when you're all your clothes are in there. And then this top part, you know, it's just for, you know, your, your pants or, you know, whatever else you need. Um, I had a kind of a hard time packing shoes in this bag. So, because, you know, again, my clothes are bigger than most people's. But, um, yeah, you can fit some extra stuff in here. Flip-flops probably a lot easier to pack than, you know, your boots or your sneakers. And one of these bags definitely will be a lot easier to use to go to a warm climate like Miami, Florida, the Caribbean, Hawaii, places like that as opposed to, you know, going to a cold climate where you need, you know, more stuff because it's cold or if you're going on a ski trip. So anyway, that's here and here. Okay. Then when you, you know, you close the bag like this. And uh, of course you set a combination on this thing, which um, I already, you know, Turn it off my combination, I'm not giving that out to you. <laughs> um, anyway, so, yep, you um, just change this. When you get the bag, you reset your combination wherever you want, it's a three digit code. You know, you put in your phone or, you know, wherever you could have it in the same place, I'd recommend your phone. Just so when you're traveling and you forget that combination, you have quick access to it. And this is a limited edition moon bag, okay? So, uh, I don't know if they still have this one, but if they do, you know, I'd recommend getting this one. Uh, the one downside to this is they're pricey. They cost a little bit of money. So just, you know, keep that in mind when, you know, get one of these. But it makes life a lot easier going through the airport because when you carry on your bag, if there's something wrong with the flight mechanical issue or they don't board it, you don't, worry have, you don't have to worry about grabbing your check bag because... That has happened to me before where I went to baggage claim and the, then the plane was reloading. I went back through security and uh, I got selected to get the pat down. So that was not a good time. So that's another reason why I recommend you have something like this on you. Just, you know, to be safe that you have a good carry-on bag. And I forgot one thing. So the handle, you know, she comes up like this. Okay. Uh, so... If there's any uh, sales on it, um, take advantage of those. There should be a promo code you can use. I have the Capital One Shopping tab on my browser, so I just click that and it looks for codes automatically for me. So if you can you know, download something like that on your browser, I recommend you do that so that um, it can find you, uh, you know, a few bucks off of this. So save a buck when you can you know, for something you're gonna buy anyway. So if you have this bag, let me know how you like it. Um, if you um, 
you know, have this bag and you hate it, let me know below. And uh, I thank you for watching this video. Take care. Have a great day.